European stocks traded higher Wednesday morning as investors digested another round of major corporate earnings reports, while uncertainty abounds over progress on a new U.S. coronavirus relief bill. The pan-European stocks 600 climbed 0.9% in early trade, with travel and leisure stocks jumping to 2% to lead gains as all sectors and major bourses entered positive territory. Investors also have an eye on negotiations in Washington over a new U coronavirus aid package, where White House negotiators on Tuesday vowed to work, around the clock, with Democratic counterparts to get a deal over the line by the end of the week. Gold has continued to surge to record highs during Asian trading hours, and spot gold was changing hands at around $2.030 per troy ounce at the European Open. July's final market composite and services PMI, Purchasing Managers Index, readings for the Eurozone are expected at 9 a.m. London time and will offer further insight into the state of the bloc's economic recovery. A sharper-than-expected gain in the manufacturing PMI at the start of the week helped stocks close out Monday's session on the front foot. June's retail sales for the Eurozone are also due at 10 a.m. Commerce Bank posted a better-than-expected 21% dip in net profit to €220 million, Euros, $260. 2 million, for the second quarter, and forecast a net loss for the full year fueled by increased loan loss provisions due to the coronavirus pandemic and the insolvency of Wirecard. Commerce Bank shares climbed 5.6%. German insurer Allianz reported a 29% decline in net profit for the quarter to 1. 53 billion euros, but said the second half of the year will be stronger than the first provided the coronavirus situation remains the same. The company's shares edged 0.5% higher Wednesday morning. BMW swung to a 666 million billion euro net loss before interest and taxes in the second quarter, down from a 2. 2 billion euro operating profit for the same period last year. The German automaker also restated its warning that pre-tax profit for 2020 will be significantly below the levels seen in 2019. Shares fell to 5% in early trade. Deutsche Post shares gained to 2% after the package delivery giant beat expectations to record a 19% rise in second quarter operating profit to 912 million euros and confirmed its full year guidance. Dutch supermarket giant Ahold Delhaize reported a better than expected rise in sales and operating profit on the back of a surge in online sales during the pandemic, sending the stock 5.2% higher. Hotel Group Accor reported a first half loss and unveiled plans to cut 1,000 jobs as part of a 200 million euro annual cost saving effort after the pandemic ravaged demand. The company's shares slid 1.2%. In terms of individual share price performance, British Airways parent IAG and low-cost carrier EasyJet climbed 8% and 7.7% 7 respectively to lead the stock's 600. At the bottom of the European Blue Chip Index, German healthcare company Fresenius dropped 